Ashley? What time of the night do you call us to be coming home at? I'm sorry, I was at Siobhan's. We were watching a movie and I lost track of the time. Ashley, don't lie to me. I saw you through the window. It's not what you think. We told you not to hang out with that boy. Have you been lying to us all this time? No. Then what were you doing driving up the road with him at this hour of the night? He took me to see some dancing. And we told you hip hop was off the limits. Not hip hop, Irish dancing. Shan oath. You expect me to believe that? Yes, and it was amazing. Better than anything Mrs. Kennedy teaches. Better than Boston. Better than anything. You have to believe me. Better than Irish dancing, is it? Yes. Listen to this, Ashley. Of course, it's disappointing not to qualify for the championships, but I do not condone just dropping it altogether. Apart from anything else, those courses cost money, Ashley. Do you think it grows on trees? Look, I can explain. Can you explain about detention? And while you're explaining, can you tell us why your aunt Stella says that we owe her 250 euro? I, um, lost some money. You lost it. The party didn't exactly work out. Ashley, why didn't you say? I shouldn't have to hear this from your uncle. I'm sorry, Mom. Have you any idea? Oh my God, the embarrassment. I don't know what to do with you, Ashley. Don't even think about looking at your father. You see, everything's always cool with you, isn't it? Now you see where it's got us. Me? What's it got to do with me? It's got everything to do with you. Who the hell brought us here, John? And you go upstairs to your bedroom. I don't even want to see you. And you can forget about your trip to Boston. 